Loss of a yard on that first place, so second down, Andy Levin. Godfrey looking left, pass is complete at the 24-yard line. With a quick, waters wide to the right, now he comes in motion. Wide open on the far side, the completion, Newsom. And Godfrey goes into the shotgun on first down from their own 34-yard line. Fakes the handoff, he's gonna run with the left side, finds a crease across midfield. 45, near the 40, and step. Second down and six. UCF at the 35-yard line of Houston. Quick screen pass, Guyton across the 25, and he's down near the 20. They begin at their own 31-yard line for their second possession. Godfrey slings it out to the near side. Up to the 40-yard line, they're unable to grab Newsom by the shirt tail, makes it a move at the 30, 25, 20, inside the 20, down to the 19-yard line. Jamar, four and a half minutes to go in the first quarter. No score, Houston at UCF. Pilot looking left now. Intercepted. And it's Bruce Miller and into the end zone, touchdown. Second interception return for touchdown of the season for Bruce Miller, who stepped right in the path of that pass from Pylon and takes it the other way. What a great play and great hands by the guy who's usually causing sacks. And he recognizes the screen. See him in your screen right there. He just backs out and makes a great play. Great instincts by him. That's a guy normally getting after the quarterback and recognized what was going on and made a great play. They're going for it on third and six, and into the end zone, touchdown, UCF. That is the halfback, Ricky Kane. Godfrey going to let it go deep for the end zone. He's got a man wide open, touchdown. A.J. Guyton. 44-yard touchdown pass. Three receivers to the right. Godfrey throws right. And right along the turf, caught. Inside. The coaches have said Sammy really has been coming on lately. Tenth play of the drive coming up for UCF. Here comes McGraw, flushing him out, running left, and he throws it, and it's caught. Newsom with the catch inside the five. Well, they actually rolled left yeah. through the football. Yeah, first time we've seen him do it. Certainly tonight. 25-yard pickup. Now, the question is, was his receiver, Newsom, actually inbounds? Great catch. Avenue for Weaver to get close to the end zone. That's the other center. Lost the snap, it appeared. Yeah. Yeah, I think he lost that again. And the way he looked coming out, he lost that ball. Looks like he did recover. And one of his teammates there, Aubrey Leggins, is trying to suggest perhaps that he recovered over the goal line for a touchdown. not had a call yet and now we do touchdown UCF <laughs> that's got to be one of the slowest touchdown calls I think I've ever seen and an odd play to get the touchdown on of the mishandled snap well that ball down well he's not in the end zone now that ball's down short of the end zone yeah they're going to review this yeah Dan Notre Dame and has built this program into something that should be attractive to the Big East they continue to build their football tradition in Orlando. Godfrey will run it. Hit at midfield, staggers forward to the 46-yard line. With the hand, it's Murray now. Throws it and has a man wide open at the 34-yard line. Pulled down at the 15. Brian Waters. 
with five receivers in there. Quick throw out to Newsom. Still in bounds. Five spins. Does not quite get in, but he's down near the two. And Gio Vanetti in the eye with Murray. K in motion. Handoff. Murray runs left and gets into the end zone. Touchdown. Knights. To pick up the first down. They need to get to the 44 of the Knights to keep it going. Pilot, plenty of time, throws, and incomplete. And Houston will turn it over on downs with 45 seconds left. And UCF will win their 11th consecutive conference game and stay unbeaten in Conference USA play. In the lead yeah, for hosting the championship game, should they make it there.